My favorite genre of Delulu guys online are the ones who are just posting a picture of themselves, writing a caption that they think is so deep and so profound, but at the end is just, you know. And when you compare it to the cringe that most women post on TikTok, those men look like rocket scientists. This is a video that came up on my For You page. And now I'm not gonna drop the user because that man is not gonna get any clout from me with his 2000 followers. But it is in German, so let me translate for you. The caption on this definitely not stage photo of him in his car. A car that you cannot afford to buy even used because the 180,000 followers you have on TikTok means that TikTok is paying you peanuts. If they're paying you at all. It says, if a car has too many kilometers on it and too many previous owners, at some point it becomes worthless. I think we all know where this is going. But if a driver has driven for many kilometers, he is a great driver. Which, mm, debatable. I've known a lot of people who have driven a car for, you know, 30 plus years and they are still not great drivers. And are they women by any chance? How dare But let's see how he ends this masterpiece of a post. I hope I don't have to explain it to you twice. I think we have all gathered what this man actually means with that video. Ladies, on today's episode of what object are we to men? We are cars. The thing is though, they will, you know, compare us to cars and equate us to cars, but they will never be as loyal to us as they are to their cars. Yes, because cars are actually dependable. This is the Broke Boy Anthem. So what do you bring to the table? Cholesterol. Lots and lots of cholesterol yeah you're broke you're a bum well like my grandpappy used to say there's no better cure for heretical alien thoughts than a cyclonic torpedo <laughs> because you're a single mom doesn't mean you're out of the game the game just begun your value so she is absolutely right you having children keeps you in the game you having children doesn't eliminate your options right every day more lies but say if you run across a man who has money and options and say if he wants to marry a woman with children or without children right and you don't tell him you have children y'all grow a bond and he finds out that you have kids men are not talkers they check they check mark things so what he's going to do is, he's going to say, okay, she's obviously embarrassed of her children or her baby father. She didn't tell me this and we've been dating for so long. What's going to happen is, he's going to use you for S- You mean, like, she used him for his money while at the same time lying about who she is? Proper garden tool. Sweetie, cut the BS. The main reason why a lot of single mothers don't mention that they are single mothers is because they know it actually severely limits their options, especially when it comes to high earning men. And no matter how much cringe and cope you post on TikTok, most of us will never, and I mean never, raise another man's kid. And if you're not down with that, we got two words for ya! Hey, my name is Kayla. I'm an S worker and I'm going to answer this question for you. Number one, um, the videos and the content that you're going to see on your like four free sites like the hub or your tube sites. A lot of that content that you see for free is very unethically sourced. I mean Sweetie, let's be real here. No content in that industry is ethically sourced. So if you don't want to contribute to things like uh, the further exploitation of people in this work then you would do something like pay for a sus uh, subscription service oh yes because that website that starts with only totally isn't exploiting women's bodies or the lonely men that paid around 5.6 billion dollars to that website in 2022 alone there's a lot of sick people in this town so if you actually respect the people what so if you actually respect the people that are performing in this content that you like to consume. <laughs> See, that's the thing, sweetie. They don't. And that's the bottom line. Cause don't go sit <laughs>